Hello everyone, welcome back to more Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness. I have taken a break in between recording sessions once again. <laughs> Damn it. But that's because of the fact that I hate the fact that my GameCube keeps fucking up. Anyway, let's go and do the Pyrite Coliseum, something I forgot. Yes, I would love to enter. Uh, yes, I would like to enter. With the Pokemon in my party. I'll do my best, don't worry about it. Also, Omega Prime at the moment is sitting at 6,433 backers. Come on, keep backing. I can't back it, but I want other people to back it. Battle 1! Yeah, I want other people to back this shit. So we can get Omega Prime done. So I can eventually actually own Omega Prime. First in line, I'll leave you tingling with shock. So electric types, eh? Resila. Yeah, the GameCube is why I haven't been recording this game as much. Because every time when I wanted to record this game, I was like... Yeah, but I'm not really in the mood for the GameCube to just go and break. Dragon... Let's go, Dragon Flying Beast! I forgot I gave these Pokemon nicknames. Ooh. They're on the level... Go. Go. Well, actually, that's not going for Dragonfly. But it also can't miss. But yeah, we got 39 days, 7 hours, and like 26 minutes or less, actually. Let me see here. Oh, we got an extra backer. But yeah, 22 minutes left. 39 days, 7 hours, and 22 minutes left. Until we, uh, until we either make or break. Omega Prime. Didn't I just uh, take you out? I don't know. I mean, I, I feel like I. Really? Why are you? Why is everything you have special? Come on, dude. Trapinch, please. No, no, not that one. Not the only one who can actually attack. Powder Snow! Well, understandable. This is an ice type. Frozen! What do you mean, Frozen? Perish! You stupid Pokemon! I'm gonna heal up <laughs> Dragonfly because this shit's insane. Can I? Yeah, I can. Okay. It is kind of difficult to see on which Pokemon I'm highlighting. I swear to God. Peach you! Oh God. Okay. Conf you know, I thought it would put me to sleep. That's what I was thinking, so I was like, no! But it's like, it's confusion, so there's a chance. We have a chance. And the chance worked! Oh my god, yes! Smoochum's dead! Finally! That annoying Pokemon's gone! Ah, of course you have to have one of these as well. I'll, ta I'll target you. Also today I finished up with my uh, recordings of my original 10 with Masterpiece Sad Swipe. Gut! Gut! My frozen block of ice! Keep dodging! Good job, Dragonfly! This is why I added you to the team! Four! Okay, so this first battle's gonna... You know, I had planned for like an hour or so recording session, and it seems like this first battle might just be all of that. All of that time! Because usually after like an hour recording session, I kind of get too tired. What do you mean, critical? Who allowed this? Who gave this the okay? Alright, what's the best Pokemon to throw out here? I think Frostbite might be the best shot that I have. Let's go, Frostbite. Yeah, for... Bah! 
Dragonfly never disappoints, but I'm still absolutely terrified. Alright, you, hey, do I gotta revive in my sack, or, uh... I think I do. What the fuck happened to my revives? I don't. Whoopsie. Here's a roar beam against that teddy ear sack. Kill it! Why did I send you out? You're weak to this. I was like an ice type. I was like, ooh, ice type. Yeah, that could be good. And it's, it's part water. Are you f I hate this place. Well, criminy, as you're still coming out. I fucking hate this place. This first trainer isn't even strong. It's just, it's just the most... An she is just the most annoying person on this... Are you... Actually serious right now? Fine. We'll do this then. Critical? Are you kidding me? Will you people stop doing this shit? I'm actually angry right now. I am so mad. Critical hit. Frozen. Like what has happened during this battle? I guess my ace is coming out now, but yeah, Flair, I'm I'm uh, counting on you. I am fucking counting on you. This bitch has just been the most annoying person on this fucking earth. How did she get that fucking freeze off? Fire blast to Pichu. Kill it. Just perish. Actually perish. In an actual house fire. I don't care. Oh my god. Also, uh, yesterday I bought every Studio Series figure I still needed. I decided to bite the bullet and go on to eBay, take money out of my savings account, and buy every Studio Series figure that I needed. Because I went to AliExpress, and in Ali uh, on AliExpress there was uh, Rumble. They had like Studio Series Rumble there, so I bought that, and then I saw a... Uh, Check them out my Pokemon form a golden trio. You better have three Pokemon or I swear I'm going to be very mad, Monar. Popeye. <laughs> he looks like Popeye. <laughs> okay, so we got Johto Starters. Oh, four. The name might be deceiving because it's this is not an actual dragon type. But who the fuck do I go into now then? I'll go into you. You actually do have three Pokemon. I respect you immediately. And you have a female Chikorita. My respect for you grows. It grows, my friend. But yeah, but I went over to AliExpress, bought myself a... Uh, that's gonna be going for... Uh, the predictable. Calculated. How did I hit this spell? But you were aiming... For criminy. Fucking calculating this shit. <laughs> I am a genius. But like I said, I went over to AliExpress, bought Rumble, and while I was scrolling through, I was like, okay, you know what? Let's see what other Studio Series figures AliExpress has. Oh, that Chikorita did not die. But let's see what other, uh, you know, like Studio Series figures they have. So I was scrolling, and I was like, oh my god. They have a knockoff of Studio Series Jetfire. And I looked at the images and I saw the fact that that one piece, which I was scared it wouldn't have, but that one piece that you need in order to connect it to, um, in order to connect Jetfire to the Dark of the Moon Optimus, because Dark of the Moon Optimus has a different chest piece, because in Dark of the Moon his chest looked different. But that connecting piece is apparently with that, uh, with that knockoff. So I was like, okay, I'm going to buy that knockoff. And then after that, I was like, okay, I only need 10 more. Because I also recently bought Studio Series Grimlock. I have him on the shelf. 
You are immediately getting switched out because I don't think anyone's coming for you. And I want Dragonfly to gain all of the experience points. Now it would probably this will probably be the best move. I was gonna go for Cyndaquil. But yeah, but uh, I bought Studio Series Grimlock. I think it's a great figure. However, the gun has like a gap in it. Which I don't really like. I knew that was coming. I did not know that was gonna happen though. There is no way. Yeah, calculating. Now return and kill it. Buy him. Buy Totodile. But like the gun has a small gap in it, but I don't like the wheelie that he comes with. It's like, it's a cool piece, but it really only works for dino mode. So it's like, I don't really care about it. Well, you're a special attacker at the moment anyway, so I don't care. But yeah, but I like the Grimlock, but I paid 155 euros for that fucker. And at that point, I was like, okay, so that's the same price I probably would have paid for eBay. So it's like, even on that side, it's going to be eBay type of prices. So I was like, fuck it. We're going off to eBay. I went into my savings account, withdrawn, like sent a bunch of money to my main uh, banking account. And then bottom. Simple bottom. I bought the remaining 10. I spent so much money. Spent around a thousand euros. Oh my god. So basically right now I have a debt to myself where it's like I'm gonna send a hundred bucks to my savings account every month starting in March. And uh, in order to kind of like recuperate the losses from the uh, studio series buyout. But I don't regret anything unless the figures don't arrive which is what I'm kind of worried about. Now, who I bought is a very simple... Let me open up the listing here. On eBay. Alright, the Legend of the Skull and Talo. But yeah, I bought... So let's see here. Studio Series Shattered the Jet Mode. I bought Studio Series Top Spin. Which has already been sent. Like, Shatter was supposed to be the earliest one to arrive. In that sense, coming in like the next two weeks. And uh, Topspin is the one who shipped. It was supposed to come at the end of February. So that's fun. Anyway, after that, I bought the Studio Series Bone Crusher. Studio Series Blitzwing from the Bumblebee movie. Studio Series Leader Class Shockwave, which cost me so much money. Uh, 100 and... 60 euros or something like that. Oh, what an annoying prick. And I bought Studio Series Drift, the helicopter one from Age of Extinction. Um, I also bought Studio Series Dropkick, which this one is technically the only one that I regret buying. After I bought him, it, it, it was like two hours later, I was like, well, I'm stupid. Because I saw on eBay, like, the set of Studio Series... Um, Dropkick and like the buzzworthy Bumblebee set where you get also like Bumblebee with it Dropkick and Bumblebee and it's like that was the one that I had planned to buy But I was but I tried to ask for like a you know like Cancel this order and then uh, immediately I got from eBay like nope not allowed. It's like son of a bitch And with and I also bought Deluxe class off-road. What the fuck did you just use against me? Of course. Not. You did so much to yourself. Did you just use swagger or something like that? No, you don't. You you don't learn swagger. Take care, Rawls. Uh, but yeah, off-road bumblebee. Dark of the moon top spin from Studio Series. I mean, Roadbuster. Sorry, top spin was already mentioned. Roadbuster, and finally. Dark of the Moon, uh, Studio Series 51, Dark of the Moon, Soundwave. Which is the only one that I'm kind of iffy about. That fucker still cost me like a hundred and... Ten euros. I was like, ah! Oh. Gut! Attack! Ha-pa! What the fuck am I supposed to do? Like, 
return doesn't work on you. Oh, I have like... It, it literally popped into my head as I clicked attack. Lick it! Lick the skull! Lick the legend of the skull! Yeah, all that stuff should arrive before like... Uh, April 16th. So I could be the proud owner of every single Studio Series figure that I missed except for that... Um, Bumblebee movie, Bumblebee, the Volkswagen Beetle one. But I want them to make a new one of that one. It's been years, Hasbro. Give us a new one. Stop with your stupid ass concept art bullshit and give us a new one of that one. Because that fucker is absolutely not accurate. Oh, we're already in the finale. What the hell happened? I feel like I blinked and I was in the final round. Yeah, but that's the only one that I technically miss. I also saw on another side, like, uh... Uh, Nitro Zeus. It's like the site that I used to buy Transformers. They got a huge like shipment, I guess, in or whatever. Like, they were just updating their site over and over again with new figures. And I saw the last night Nitro Zeus, and I was like, should I buy that one? I mean, it, the, he doesn't have a Studio Series figure yet, but they might just reuse that figure for a Studio Series, which they already did with uh, KSI Boss. If I remember correctly, which I do. All right, we need to take the fucking electric type. Uh, let's go with this. Let's just do have some fun. But uh, anyway, I was thinking about it, and then when I made my decision, for, like, fine, I'm gonna buy him. He was sold out. And I was like, fuck. That decision took like two minutes to make. That fucker was sold out two minutes in. <laughs> God. So annoying. You're gonna heal because you are action. God no. Where's the... Oh, it's on Crimini. But yeah, I, it took so... It was uh, sold out so fast. Like, uh, there were other hawks eyeing that site. Yeah, and also, the, in that shipment, they also got in, like, Studio Series Grimlock, which I was like, INSTANT BUY! Because I am not missing you! Because I had it with this before. It happened with Darksteel. I put Darksteel in my shopping cart, and then I was like, you know what? The fuck does that- How are you dead? Oh, uh, actually, I don't care. <laughs> don't care. Better to send out. I think I'll send out you. Grimini! Because uh, this time I, I know there's an electric type on the field. Ah, this works against you. Surprisingly enough. But I, I. Like the first one that I saw was like Prime Dark Steel. And I was like, are you from the show? So I typed it into TFK and I was like, yeah, you are from the show. Because they first got Grimwing, which is not from the show. And then they got the repaint of Grimwing, which is uh, Darksteel. And I was like, maybe I should buy you. So I put, you in the sh uh, put him in the shopping cart. And then I was like, I opened up my phone to look at the list of figures that on this site that I had my eye on. And I was like, there's a dog barking outside. I was like, let's see what they have. And when I did that, I misclicked and went got sent back to the main page and Darksteel was gone. I was like, fuck! So after that, it was like, I'm insta-buying Grimlock. No bullshit. I am not thinking, okay? I'm not gonna be thinking about it. I'll insta-buy you. I will instantly pick you up. And so I spent 155 euros on Grimlock and I was like, no. What did I do? Alright, so I got a grass type and a ground type, so I'm basically solid, but the ground type doesn't know any ground type moves, so I'm still fucked. No shadow, don't need to react to the fucking dogs outside here, fuck it. There is a chance shadow might fuck soon. I do not know if this is going to happen, but the possibility does indeed exist, and it's a very sad possibility. Die, Plusle. What the hell? Perish. 
But now I'm basically done with the studio series, except for the fact that all the figures that I ordered. Ba -ba -ba. I heard those noises. We're about to bark. But I still need to get them. So by the time this comes out, I think I should be the proud owner of every studio series figure. Main studio series figure that I actually give, care about. And I can be happy. I can finally put that load off my back. Huh. Jesus. Oh my god. That fucking shit could have been sheer cold. Oh, wait, defense. I thought it just lowered attack. But that could have been sheer cold for all I knew. God, you are also so weak. Oh, grass, that Pokemon is so fucking pathetic in the first three generations. Until you get to, like, energy ball and, like... Uh, well, that's a good physical move. Actually, I'd say Generation 4 ain't that much better either. But yeah, Metronome could have been anything. How am I locked? Come on, Cable, work with me. Come on, there you go. Let me go. But I'm so happy that the first 10 reviews are done, which means now I'm free, and, well, tomorrow I'm not gonna record anything, because I'll be gone from the afternoon, which is my normal time of recording. Uh, so Tuesday I will do a double review. And what is a double review? It's two reviews recorded at the... Uh-oh. Same time. Ah, well, thank you. But it's two reviews recorded at the same time. So basically, robot mode, robot mode. Vehicle mode, vehicle mode. Kind of like that. Instead of going robot mode, transformation, vehicle mode. It will be robot mode, robot mode. Transformation, transformation, vehicle, vehicle. It will be like that. And it's going to be the Jazzy Boys. The Origin Jazz and the Studio Series Jazz. And eventually, it's gonna become a jazz week. Where on Tuesday, you're gonna get Origin Jazz, and on Friday, uh, and on Saturday, you're gonna get Studio Series Jazz. This year, by the way. I did it. I won the title. I'm champion of the fight. Oh my god, criminy! Yes! You're evolving! My beautiful shroom. Spread your legs and arms, grow everything! My beautiful criminy, you have evolved into Breloom, the powerful Breloom. Finally, now learn the mock fist. Now my issue with this is, what do I do? Because like, false swipe could be useful to take out like, uh... Oh fuck, what was it called? False Swipe can actually be useful for taking out, um, not taking out, but lowering the health. Headbutt's a powerful attack, so should I get rid of False Swipe or Mock or Headbutt? I might, I'll go for False Swipe. Screw it. Ah, oh, <laughs> I thought it was going to ask me. Oh, well, RIP to False Swipe. Welcome, Mock Fist. Because, like, it could be useful to lower the health of Pokemon, but... No, I mean, that fucking thing's gonna die anyway. I did it! Congratulations for winning your challenge! What a marvelous round of battles! Here's your prize money of 3,040! And another prize we also present you with this TM31. That's Brick Break! There will not be a next challenge.